in many ways, things haven't changed. Like the things that you were doing, like with the Oscars and influencer marketing or working with quote unquote ambassadors for your brand, that still works today, but in the online spot, like in the online world with your TikToks, your YouTubers, like, are you doing any of that? Um, yes. So the markets shifted from trying to dress an actress on the red carpet, going to an event. I mean, that that still exists. We do VIP dressing. But really, um, it's shifted to influencers. So, um, you know, and you have different types of influencers. So you have the type of influencer that has millions of followers, right, which they're not always the best to work with because the people who follow them are probably just fans and they're, they're not going to convert into customers for us. But people have a lower following and people are really engaged with them and they're following them because they like what they're wearing. They like the way they mix outfits. They like the brands that they talk about. Those are the ones that convert better. Um, so it's it's finding you know, also you've got to find the influencer that's the right aesthetic for your brand because it really depends on are those followers going to like my brand? So it's got to be the right fit. You don't want to go out to any influencer who doesn't, has the wrong aesthetic or the wrong message. Um, they've got to be on, on brand. Hey, Founder Fam, we hope that you loved that clip. If you did, you can click through right here to watch the full interview. You don't want to miss this one. See you there.